The Toronto Blue Jays are flying south for the winter. But the team hopes an old school manager and some strong pitching can send them back north in the AL East standings. In the early 90s, Cito Gaston coached the Blue Jays to win back-to-back -back World Series titles. He says there are some similarities between those championship teams and his current club, but there's still plenty of work to do. We have some good young kids coming along here, you know, as Lynn and Snyder, and uh, you know we can get Rios back to where he was a year, a couple of years ago, and certainly get get uh, Vernon Wells healthy again, and uh, we'll have to have a big year out of Overbay and also out of uh, Roland. Um, so if we can do those sort of things, we can get back to those years. Pitching is a hot commodity in the AL East, and while most of the focus is on the Red Sox and Yankees, some of the best talent may lie north of the border. The Toronto Blue Jays' rotation continues to be one of the most underrated in the league. We, we also led the league in ERA in the bullpen, so my bullpen's pretty good. Just pretty good? Last season, the Blue Jays suffered injuries left and right, but they still managed to be the first team in over 40 years to lead the AL in both categories. Despite these injuries and players leaving, Jeremy Accardo says there should be no change in the way this team performs. I expect the same. You know, you go out there every time and, and you give it your best. You make your pitches and do whatever, you know, whatever inning I'm pitching and try to help the team win. Pitcher Casey Jansen says there's no stress for this rotation. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say there's much pressure. I mean, you know, no one has a 100-mile-an-hour fastball. And, uh, you know, we all are our own kind of pitchers and we have our own style. So, uh, you know, we're just going to go try and do our own thing and, uh, you know, Hopefully keep our team in the game and, uh, you know, when we're, when we're pitching, hopefully, you know, we get the wins. Reporting from Dunedin, Florida, I'm James O'Leary. Now we send it over to Evan Anderholm, who has a report on the Orioles.